It's one day till spring, and you're probably thinking about new clothes for the new season. Early Show Style contributor Katrina Zish is here with five of the hottest spring trends this year, and they all cost under $100. Great to have you with us, as always, Katrina. Good morning. What's the trend for the season? I mean, what big picture are we looking at? We're looking at a season where there's fun in fashion again. It yeah. was a little bit kind of morose there for a sure. while. Fun is back, so I'm really excited to go shopping for the spring. And you don't have to spend a lot of money to get these trends. And we love it when we've got all the trends here. So bright colors is one of them. And bright certainly colors. that speaks fun to me. It sure does. This is like opening a bright box of crayons. We're not talking about little <laughs> touches of color. We're talking head to toe color, mixing those colors too. Purples, pinks, greens. Here we've got these great trousers from Zara for $89. And we also mixed in a great top from Cynthia Steffi. We have a little bit of an asymmetrical look going here. Purple trimmed with pink. And then we really played up the fun with those accessories. We've got the bright bag. We've got the bangle, which is about $3. We've That's got great, great Jessica Simpson shoes. Always uh, the go-to really for platforms, fun shoes. Is there a color combination that doesn't work here? Because really, it looks like you can throw all the crayons in the crayon box together and it, it works out. Exactly. I mean, obviously, you just want to make sure that if all the colors together look pretty, then that's great. You don't want to overdo it by throwing in lots of prints. Mm. But I mean, really, it's, you're going to have to use your artistic eye for so this So the one. trick is solids here. Solids, exactly. Thank you so much, Deanne. We appreciate Thanks, Deanne. it. Neutrals, <laughs> another big one this season. On the completely different part of the color wheel here, neutrals are huge. You can go white or you can go with this great, beautiful sand color like we see on Blair here. She's wearing this great Calvin Klein dress that we found on sale at shopattoomy.com, mm. as well as these great Tory Burch little booties. But again, it's keep it fun with the accessories. We've got the safari inspired dress. We kind of spruced it up with gold accessories. Gold accessories are also something that will really bring you forward into the spring. Gold accessories, and that seems like it keeps it a little modern and maybe even dresses it up a touch. Exactly, because this color, you can think, okay, I can, I have khakis that color, but <laughs> instead of just going for the khakis, go for the shirt dress, go for something in a wash silk like this, and again, play with those accessories to keep the look. Blair, thank you. Trend. 70s chic is another one. I mean, you can't walk down the street in New York without seeing 70s chic in every store Absolutely. window. Absolutely. It was the same when we saw all of the spring shows on the runway. Designers sent down tons of 70s gear. Here, Jackie looks amazing in this sort of 70s inspired look. And yes, everyone, high waisted jeans are back. They're <laughs> all different cuts out there, they work for everyone. These we found for $63 on ASOS, and we paired it with a crossbody bag, which we mm -hmm. got in Zappos, which is one of the most important bag silhouettes of the season. And then you can't go wrong with an oversized hat. Wear it to the yeah, beach. Yeah, I love that. Wear it down the street. Again, playing with accessories is key. But you don't want to look costumey, so we kept it simple with a white shirt and a neutral belt. Good point. Thank you to Jackie, our model. Thanks, Jackie. Hemlines. This is always the question every season. Where are they going to be? Longer, shorter? We have the hemline of the season here. We sure do. I mean, you know, I, hemlines are fickle this season, I like to say. Okay. And minis are in, maxis are in, but also the new length is the midi. Hmm. M-I-D-I, the midi length. And as you can see here on Orchidae, it falls below the knee. It can even go down to mid-calf. Now, Orchidae is petite, so it shows that you don't have to be of Amazonian proportions sure. to pull off this length. And the way to do that is by looking for a more of an asymmetrical hem. So, so you can see more of that leg. You see a touch of knee, but here we've got this great dress we found for $93 it looks at great. Macy's. Rachel by Rachel Roy, and we added a great um, Jack Rogers clutch. Orchidae, thank you so much. We appreciate it. Thank you. Stripes, I love this. This is always the sign of summer or spring that it is. stripes are in it the house. It makes you want to say ahoy. It's very <laughs> nautical, and you feel that. But this season, it's not just about nautical. Here we have a twist on nautical. It's a silk top from Zara, $60. We added it with some washed silk uh, uh, shorts, which mm -hmm. is a great way to go. Kept it dressy with the shoes on the bottom as well. So it just doesn't have to be something you'd wear at the beach mm -hmm. or on a boating trip. This can work for any occasion. We even saw uh, Misha Prada did stripes for evening gowns. So we're seeing it in all different varieties. So even more formal, you can dress it up. Yes, from day to night. I like also that you don't just have to do the blue and white stripe. You can play it up with something You'll else. You'll see so many colors out there. Kind of a spin on the bright Yep. You'll see that as well. You'll also see them in neutrals. Thank you to all of our models. Thank, Thank you, you to you as well. Katrina, Thank always you, great to have you with us.